Hey guys, so I just wanted to make a really quick video showing you how I am extending my billy cage. Now if you've seen the billy cage before, I do have a tutorial on it if you haven't, uh, which I will link below. But this is my original billy cage, I made this for Amelie's who was a very old lady, didn't move around much, didn't have much need for a lot of space. But now because we are going to be getting a new hamster who is going to be very young and very sprightly, we are extending the cage. So what I have here is another billy cage, although this one isn't quite finished yet, I still need to put the glass along the front, but it's got the lid, it's all set up, and it's identical to this one apart from the glass. To join these two cages together, I have done one very, very simple thing, only requires one tool, and that is a drill with a circular cutter on the end. Now you can see here where the two cages meet, there's the two walls of each one, and if I move this cage, you can see where it separates. And all I had to do was take this tool and cut one hole in this wall, and in the exact same position on this wall, cut another hole the exact same size. Then all you have to do is to push the two cages together and the two holes will line up, giving your hamster access to both sides of the billy cage. It's really as simple as that. It took about 10 minutes at most. Now if you want to, you can secure these two sides of the cage together permanently, but one of the best upsides for this cage for me is that because we are going to be moving around quite a lot in our life, we need a cage that is easy to transport without it getting broken. So when we want to move, all we have to do is put the hamster in a travel cage and separate the two cages and that's it. Really easy for us to move around. We don't have to worry about the cage being awkward to get upstairs or through lifts. And the hamster still has a lovely big home. So there we go, that is how to extend the billy cage. And the great thing about this is you really can make these cages as big as you want. You can just keep buying extensions for it. You can buy an extension half the size of this, you can buy a second one this size, and you can just keep making it bigger and bigger and bigger. So thank you guys very much for watching this video. If you found it helpful, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up to help support the channel. Also, don't forget to share the video with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.